Hey, what's up, guys? This is Prison Flash, and this video is a reply to XCal's video titled "From the Desk of XCal Episode 2. Um, um, in his video, he talks negatively about himself, but it, for me, it's otherwise. Um, I think he's a great guy, and I'm gonna tell you why. But first of all, um, let's talk about Call of Duty community first. Um, I gotta say that without XCal and Blame Truth, um, this Call of Duty would not have grown as big, okay? Or it would have taken them a lot longer. Because they were one of the few people who actually posted um, Call of Duty gameplays on YouTube and this was back in 2008 uh, mid 2009 that's that's when I uh, actually uh, started watching um, Call of Duty um, specifically Call of Duty uh, for Modern Warfare um, I bought PS3 because of my cousin he was playing Call of Duty Modern Warfare and then you know I played it and it was really really fun so that was my first console multiplayer experience yes um, I used to play on PC uh, I used to play a game called Soldier Front it's free online and it's a first player shooter too but you know I used to be a PC player pretty much um, but that's not the point uh, let's get to the point okay so I was not used to the whole controller thing I'm used to mouse and keyboard so I decided to actually YouTube um, how to become better at Call of Duty. Yeah, that was my exact title. <laughs> um, and I found, I, I came across to Blame Truth's video. Um, he's my first, very first subscriber, or not, not subscriber, the very first person that I subscribed to, and XCal was my second. So BT, um, he took my subscribing V card in a sense <laughs> uh, but yeah anyways I'll get uh, to the point um, uh, before I met XCal or I found out about XCal uh, Blame Truth uh, he actually made you know, commentary videos um, with giving uh, giving tips and whatnot whereas XCal uh, he was just posting gameplays without commentaries but it was because of Blame Truth XCal decided to do commentaries. Um, uh, one of his XCal's old videos, uh, it, he's he says something like this: "He's like, damn you, blame truth, and this is how I feel about you." And he has a picture of Grandpa Simpson, like yelling at the clouds or something like that. It was hilarious. Um, I mean, yeah. But anyways, um, XCal had a very monotone voice. He sounded like he did not want to do commentary, you know. He he just wants to like get it over with, you know. But now he sounds so excited, you can tell the energy and whatnot. Um so his commentary has gotten a lot better. Um before both of them came really, really big, um or became really, really big, uh, you know, I used to talk to BT and XCal on YouTube like personal messages and um, one of the one of the messages I actually sent to blame truth was hey uh, what's your internet connection and this is when he lived with his parents and he was going to college uh, he said that you know five um, downloading speed and five megabytes downloading speed and one megabyte uploading speed so it wasn't great but he's still posted very well done gameplays whereas XCal um, his video, he was asking people, you know, why Call of Duty 4 sucks. And I wrote him a huge, long, like, uh, personal message, and he actually replied back. And guess what? XCal explained every single thing in details. He was talking about head glitches. You know, it's always been there since, like, Call of Duty 1, you know, or other multiplayer games um, and stuff like that. But, you know, overall, uh, they're both very nice guys. And I don't know about you guys, but, um, you know, like, people are asking XCal or Blame Truth that they should 1v1 each other. 
and um, on Blame Truth's channel, he wrote, "Tell me a good reason why I should do one v one with Xcal. Then I'll I'll consider it." Whereas Xcal, he's like, you know, um, Blame Truth and I are the same person, and that's how the whole shenanigans started. Um, like, if you watch uh, Xcal's video uploaded on Machinima Respawn, um, him going like. 64 or 78 I, I don't remember the exact number but he was using striker and they would be like oh we are the same person you know like jokingly and uh, that's where it came from um, but yeah um, xcow man he really changed the whole YouTube community and also blame truth uh, with pyro puncher hutch um, and optic um, I did not know who optics were uh, I know they were posting like a montage, a montage, a montages of like sniping, you know. But that was about it. <clears throat> Anyways, uh, you know, if you watch any of my gameplays, my game style is actually from X X cows and also Blame Truth's um, tips and methods. Um, you know, I play. Uh, I'm a passive aggressive player, which is a. Uh, you know, you get many kills as you can in one spot and move to the next. Don't stay in the same spot, you know, that method and the whole thing. But anyways, um, you know, Xcal and Blame Truth, they, they're not in for the money like when they first started. They, they were just posting videos for fun, you know. But now it's like becoming the whole YouTube money and whatnot. You see um, like Wings of Redemption, Woody. Um, and other famous or big youtubers out there um, now it's 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 becoming part of business part of making money but the thing is that you know Xcal and blame truth they were always like you know posting the same thing you know they, they haven't changed you know they haven't changed except for uh, their channels grew but but they haven't changed their personality stayed the same Xcal he is um, he's a nice guy I mean he would say like curse at you sometimes you know if you're being really bad but you know Xcal he's more of a, <clears throat> a person who actually cares about his subscribers uh, I don't know if you guys ever watched one of his twitch live streams and he would say things like hey uh, how's the views guys or how's the how's the video quality and then he would change it he would actually restart his computer and make it higher quality or better quality uh, he's that kind of guy I mean uh, but the, don't don't ask him like you know um, you should post this gameplay man you know don't do that he's gonna block you why because you're annoying him okay and he doesn't like whiners either don't whine this is how you approach the X cow okay tell him ask him a question hey do you like this game and then he would say either yes or no. It's a piece of shit and I don't like it. That's that's his response. But uh, Blame Truth on the other hand, he's more chilled. And he'll be like, well, yeah, I'll think about it or I'll consider it. Anyways, guys, um, the video is winding down. And uh, hopefully um, you guys know about XCal and Blame Truth. Um, you know they're both great guys I've been a loyal subscriber not an old-time subscriber but a loyal subscriber okay you should watch their vids I think I, I find Xcal and BT a lot more entertaining than any other guys out there anyways peace out